I hope you guys enjoy those shows we do. And we start talking about music, right? And one of the things we're talking about is um, Def Rebel. We were talking about the AI music memes of them and, um, you know, people saying they're trash and bring back Jim Johnston, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Here's the guy from, uh, so people are snitch tagging. Like, this is what I don't like. And I'm about to bury the e-drones right now. See? So people, oh, you're a, you're a fucking, um, you're a hater. Uh, you're an AEW hater, Phil. No, I'm fucking not. Okay. Hey, Triple H. So this guy, Vic, I follow him. Shout out Vic, 8122. Like, a good follow, you know, very pro WWE. But he snitch tags Triple H. He goes, hey, Triple H, Def Rebel is out here misrepresenting the company. Jim Johnston would never do this. Like, what? Why bring them? What are you trying to get these guys fired? And then he goes, I'm just saying. And then this is Hotspot. So we'll play this video. Douglas J. Davis, who I guess is like, so... I guess Def Rebels, like, a group of people. I, I don't even know how to explain it. It's two guys for sure. But then they have, like, other people who rotate in and out or whatever, I guess. And this guy, like, is, like, a coordinator or a producer or he oversees or whatever, whatever, whatever. And so here's him. And I don't know. You guys Google it. Google it if you think that if I'm representing this guy wrong. Like, he's, like, their producer of deaf rebel sort of shit you know he like coordinates it type thing he's not actually like in the group um but he's falsely accused an uber driver of anti-semitism because they couldn't all fit in the car so he called like the wrong uber and it's this is rich people shit basically but we're about douglas j davis falsely accused an uber driver of anti-semitism because his family was too big for the car i heard you say under your breath they look jewish what what for so luckily this guy was filming because this guy out of nowhere goes, I heard you say under your breath, they look Jewish. Whoa. Four times Grammy Award winner booked an Uber black car for four instead of an SUV for five without child seats. And when the driver refused to transport them for safety reasons, the man immediately started playing victim. I'm being Please explain. You know I'm what I can do, CEO. So whatever. I mean, we, it's, it, you're you're racially profiling us like all of this thing. And there's a lot of anti-Semitism, if you will. And this ain't a political pod. This is, but just my thoughts on this. Don't snitch tag the guy. They'll find out obviously, but like people really want him fired um, that bad. 